first things first. Hello, how are things going? Um, I want to know how things this week a little bit different than last week for you, perhaps here at practice or in the locker room. Um, what do you mean by that? Uh, you know, with our bro boys, I mean, <laughs> we, love, we love Barch. Yeah, I was, yeah. yeah um, obviously, I hate to see what happened to Barch. You know, great player, great guy. Um, but, you know, just trying to step in where I can and help out the team. Uh, I mean, I don't know. I, I definitely had some struggles. There's things I got to clean up, but I think a lot of it was just like I've got a lot, of, got a lot of good guys around me. You know, I go in there. I mean, Cam's playing at a high level. Luke's playing at a high level. And I feel like no matter where I go in, like, you know, it, it helps when everybody else is playing well, and that can kind of uh, disguise where, where I might fall short when I'm coming in. How is it different coming in at the bar position versus coming in at the center position? Uh, well, obviously, at center, you have to snap the ball. And, uh, um, uh, it's different, yeah. Centers, you know, you're a little bit more steering the ship. And guards, uh, you know, you're just, I mean, it's a different animal. There's, you know, you're blocking three techniques, and not as many, and not the nose guard as much. So, uh, I mean, there's a lot of differences, but I don't want to bore you. No, you're good. You can keep going. You can bore me. What, or if you want to give uh, specifics of maybe where you saw the areas you have to improve from last week to going into this week, maybe. Uh, I mean, honestly, I mean, I. I feel like there's always room to improve everywhere. Pass pro is always different. You know, at guard, there's a little bit more space. But i uh, been working on it and just trying to, like I said, just play my part and help the team. You've obviously been a part of quite a few offensive lines here in Jacksonville. What's separating this one right now compared to some of the others, or what makes it unique? I think we've always had uh, a real close offensive line. That's And that's, you know, that also helps, like what we were talking about, just being able to fill in. I think everybody's real comfortable with, e with each other. We've all um, – you know, during camp and stuff, this is kind of a rotation thing anyways. Like, we're all working with each other. Um, but this is definitely a special line. You know, we got some really good players, and then everybody bonds so well. Where do you feel this group has grown the most from training camp to where they are now? I would say just uh, I think we're real cohesive right now. Um, you know, guys are getting used to playing next to each other, and uh, that helps a lot a lot. Since you've been here, obviously, quite a few years, what's the biggest transition from Warhawks Steeling to now um, I mean, like you said, just a different scheme, you know. Uh, in the past, we've been a lot more uh, gap schemes downhill. In this one, we're kind of running a little bit more, uh, trying to create the stretch and get the seams. So, uh, you know, it's obviously different, but still football. Is it exciting for you to get out there in space a little bit more, or is that, has it been a challenge with the different scheme? Uh, I mean, yeah, it's, it's, it's exciting. You know, we got some really good running backs, and it's always fun to try to be able to get them going.